Grand Bahama Power Company supplies electrical power to the island of Grand Bahama from West End to Sweetings Key in the east. Just off the north shore of the island is Water Key. GBPC supplies electricity to less than a dozen customers on the key which is not tied directly into our transmission system. Power is generated on Water Key by two single-phase diesel generators. To fuel the generators, GBPC staff load 330 gallons of diesel from our Peel Street plant, transported 40 miles east, and then to Water Key via a ferry boat every two weeks. So the Water Key Solar Project is an initiative that we decided to undertake to mitigate largely environmental risk, but also safety risk as well. The safety that our employees are exposed to by having to transport 45 gallon drums across the water in a Boston whaler to get it over to Water Key. I mean, if, if every two weeks you're transporting six or eight 45 gallon drums of, of fuel across that open waterway, and given the state of the dock on both sides of the, uh, of, of the waterway, it was just too much risk that at some point there's going to be a spill. And we didn't, you know, Grand Bahama Power, we put a lot of, uh, it's one of our important principles is upholding the environment, being stewards for the environment. And no one is asking us to do this, but we just wanted to proactively manage the risk before there was an event, as opposed to waiting for an event and then, and then responding to it. Deepwater Key and Sweden's Key are connected to Grand Bahama by under undersea cable. Water Key is not. Could it be? Could be. But the cost would be prohibitive. Generally costs you about a million dollars a mile for to run transmission and uh, the distance between Grand Bahama Highway out to the edge and then underwater just would not, it would never justify it for the amount of residents that are in Water Key. Grand Bahama Power Company is going to install a microgrid which consists of renewable energy and clean burning propane fuel. There will be a combination of solar panels, batteries for backup power and a propane generator for additional reliability. During the day when the sun is shining, the solar panels will provide enough energy for the residents on Water Key and also be used to charge the batteries. Once the sunshine falls off during the nighttime, the batteries will begin to discharge. If the batteries become depleted or the sun is not shining, the propane generator then kicks in, which will charge the batteries and provide enough energy to serve the residents on Water Key. The main driving force behind this project is to actually mitigate the environmental risk of a fuel spill. There are three main goals that drive our environmental commitment. One, investing in clean fuel sources. Two, being good stewards of the environment and identifying risks and mitigating them at our own cost. And three, building relationships and trust with our customers to prove our commitment to them and the environment. In our view, uh, they will be the benefactors of, of something that is really aligns with their ecotourism desires. The Water Key Solar Initiative provides a clear example of GBPC's commitment to diversifying our energy mix and stabilizing electricity costs for the benefit of Grand Bahama's energy future. We're changing the way we serve our Water Key customers.